Is it possible Tennessee, who, by the way, was number one for a couple of weeks in the college football playoff rankings a year ago, is it possible for Tennessee to stay at that level that we saw a year ago? What is the University of Tennessee at quarterback? I just mean as a program. Is this really the kind of program that has found themselves in the sweet spot such that pretty much any quarterback is going to thrive here. I like Lincoln Riley in his career. Seems like everyone turns into a Heisman Trophy contender. Is that Josh Heupel? Because 2022 for Tennessee was magical. You beat Alabama. You make a New Year's Six Bowl. Hennon Hooker was on track to win the Heisman Trophy. You confirm emphatically Josh Heupel is the right guy for the job down there. 2023, to me, the polls at Tennessee is why not us? We forget that Tennessee is, has always been a major power in college football, but they've just fallen so far off the stage. So it's not as difficult for Tennessee to suddenly uh, get everything clicking because they have they have the infrastructure there. Wherever you listen throughout the world, it's football time in Tennessee. There's a pass play that's there. Jalen Hyatt, touchdown. Now he's going to go deep. Got a man out there. Oh, what a catch. Diving catch by Keaton. Okay. Going deep. Man's there. Got it. Jalen Hyatt, touchdown. Richardson pressured. Throws at the last moment, and it's intercepted by the Volunteers. There will be no comeback. Tennessee wins it. Chase McGrath for the win for the Volunteers. From 40. On the way, a knuckleball. He got it! And here they come. see what he did in the Orange Bowl? I don't feel like that's just a one-off. I think that's a preview to the movie we're going to get in 2023.